Oh my God, you guys, this bike is incredible. What just happened? I left my camera just like this in the car, outside in the street, on the seat. In Woodstock, and, and it, it was survived. Still, it was still there this morning. Fear of death in me, as I realized it wasn't my. I was like, where? Oh no! <laughs> I got out there. I, could, I was actually couldn't believe that the car hasn't been broken into. Celeste, did you hear that? That's so lucky. Today's gonna be a good day. What is the mission today? The mission? Well, I don't know what your mission is. My mission right now is to get fresh air and maybe some food. And then I've got band rehearsals for this upcoming tour this whole the whole day and you've got plenty of and I've editing got to, to do. Listen to it. Yeah, I've got editing to do. And also I'm gonna be test riding a motorcycle today. Oh stop it, I forgot about that. If it's how I think it's gonna be, and it's how everybody says it's gonna be, I'm gonna buy that guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sweet belt. Yeah, I was feeling edgy this morning. I needed it. I was. You need to get out we of the house. So, yeah, we were so excited for waves this morning, and it just yeah. didn't happen. Yeah, we had a plan A this morning that didn't go through. We were meant to go surfing. Jeremy has band practice, and I have work to do, so we can just mission so far away. It's, I think we it was the sensible choice. It yeah. was the sensible choice, but it yeah. left us feeling a little bit empty inside. Yeah. And so now we're going to go fill that hole with some nature. Yeah, we're going to go. <laughs> <laughs> That's one way of putting it. So you're gonna to commit to that then, bro. I was thinking about it. Then I was just thinking about staying alive. Kirsten Bosch Gardens, everybody. It's, it's probably not a better place to come and be in nature. It is the bomb, and this yeah. is like my favorite music venue to play as well. We're playing on the 4th of February. Um, yeah, next year. Filthy Nikon. Oh, how dare you! Beautiful, sweet, sweet, delicious Nikon. Healthy, healthy snack time. Yeah. Coffee, nice coffee, coffee, coffee. These are the best bonsai trees I've ever seen. 60 years old, that one. It's amazing. That is amazing. They have signs everywhere that says don't touch, but the first thing you want to do is just walk up and just... 80 years old, dude. This is a wild olive, I reckon. I had a bonsai like this once, so it was small, maybe. We're just looking at the mountain. Yo. We need to explore it more. This is what we really came for, the treetop, the tree canopy walkway. Oh yeah. This is Louis's future tree house. Obviously not this one, but I think that's what he's after. Look how beautiful this place is. Actually kind of what I'm gonna try and do a lot more is sort of make the effort to go offline a little bit, just for an hour or two, and just go and hang out in the middle of nature. Get out the house and go and reconnect. So yeah, it's good timing. You feeling clear? Yeah, this was exactly what we needed. This is, I reckon, the path we would want to go up. It's called Nursery Ravine, and that's like... Um, we can go all the way along the top? Yeah, you that's can. What I think the main, like, if you see the actual ravine... It's so good that they built this. This canopy path is exactly what was needed here. It, like, just brings this whole space together. Imagine if this was your garden. I want this to be my garden one day. Something like this, like a smaller version of this, but this. This whole vlog is pretty much just me following you around. Dude, this is my favorite section of this whole place by far. It's like the um, dinosaur section because these are old cycads and cycads are like a really old type of, of plant. How old did it say these cycads are? Did you read? No. Going back. How old are they? Uh, 65. 65 million years old. Basically, when the dinosaurs got extinct from that asteroid striking the Earth, 75% of life on Earth was wiped out, except for these guys. They survived. These are the survivors. I feel like all my horticultural brownies are going to be having a field day with this vlog. You do not want to accidentally stumble into a bunch of those, do you? Gosh, that is sure. I, think there's a I love this camera so much. There's a picture actually. waiting to happen. Yeah, get it, bro. Ooh. Come stick your face in here. What? I'm not sticking my face in the bush. Face between me and it there. I wonder how old these specific plants are. Yeah, that's what I want to know. Quench that first. Slurp it. Ah. Sweet, sweet H2. Oh, yeah. Check out all these beautiful flowers. It does help that it's spring. Exactly. This is a particularly good time of year to come and visit Kirsten Bosch. <laughs> we sound like the ultimate horticultural enthusiast today. There would be the two kitchen colors, like off white slightly green and that gross kitchen cupboard orange 
Do you have kitchen cupboard orange by the chance? <laughs> I do actually. And avoid noises like that. Yeah, put your seatbelt on. You're always way ahead of me with that, aren't you? What, with the seatbelt thing? Yeah, you're really good. Yeah, dude, it's because I grew up first. in the UK, where it's like, our police actually pull us over if we don't have a seatbelt on. Do they? Yeah, definitely. If they see, if a policeman in the, in a, a traffic cop in the UK sees you don't have a seatbelt on, like, he, you'll get pulled over. How will they even see that though? Because they are looking. That's why they care. <laughs> <laughs> they really care, dude. Did in you the UK. Far apart, like too fast in the car. No. If you, no, they see you, dude. See. And they have a lot of unmarked police cars as well. So imagine. Don't they have any. How, how more often do you see people? Pumba! Back home. SP should be here. S to the Pizang. Hello. Hello, mate. How's it going? I'm going to go and test ride this motorcycle. It's KTM. We'll take it out and about for half an hour, 45 minutes, something like that. I've only really ridden BMWs ever, so it's gonna be fun. I don't know why I'm putting this jacket on, I'm going in an Uber now. Guys, this bike is incredible! I am in love with this motorcycle. Wow. Oh, it's so much fun. Yeah, look at this place, guys. Look at this place. This is why I love this city. Check it out. Oh my god, this is really tall. This bike is so tall, I can barely touch the floor, but look. Look at this place. I, I have no choice, guys. I need to buy this motorcycle. I'm in love with it already. I've been on it for 19 minutes and I'm in love with it. Guys, I am in love. Hello? SB! What's up? What's up, man? Hey, this bike, though, is ridiculous. How many backflips have you done? Um, I lost count, bro. Do you want to come down and meet me at KTM? I think i got to get this guy. I'll yeah? Enough. All right, cool. I'm on Signal Hill, so I'll race you there. I am saying yes to this bike massively. I can't believe I didn't think of getting a bike like this before. This is such a great idea. Cape Town! All right, let's do this. It is very tall. Jeremy's having a band practice at the moment, and I just got a phone call from old Benjamin, El Benjamino, uh, saying, get down to KTM. Um, I think I've got to get this guy. So I'm gonna head down there, and we'll go have a look. Won't stop, won't stop in the cyclone. It rains, it pours when you're near me, baby. Move close to the fire, you're the one who's crazy. Who that looks like. <laughs> ah! 
Hello, mate. <laughs> Why you have to do this to me? Now I have to buy it. Yeah. <laughs> you knew, didn't you? It's a nice bike. Yeah. Yeah, I, I knew it. Nice. That's it, guys. I've done it. This is my new motorcycle. Collecting on Monday. Thank you so much, dude. I'll okay. see you Monday. Cheers. Don't stop, that was going to be my backing track, that was my audio for today's oh, vlog. Oh, so sorry, we couldn't do your vlog music for you. Get some practice. You guys are the worst, you guys are the worst. Bye. Where are you going? I'm going for sundown dinner with Nicole. Bullsh- what? What? You Bullsh- can't just, You can't just leave us <laughs> for sundown dinner. Hello, my baby. Hey, buddy. How are you? I'm good, how are you? It's not like a huge mission, we're just going to go grab a craving, which is really weird, like a juice. Like a burny ginger juice. Hopefully it's gonna be a banging sunset. Got a, a sleeping bag, the boyfriend, the best friend, and me are just gonna go chill somewhere. I mean, Watch. how big is the sleeping bag? We're back at the healthy new spot. Also, Kaylee's here. Hello. Welcome back to the vlog. Thank you very much. How are you? I'm on holiday. I'm oh, yeah. teacher, you have kids. Children are great. <laughs> we have the treats. Thank you. Have a good weekend. Thank you, you too. It's a lovely, nice man. Lovely man. Well, where do we go? I've been craving about? Mexican food. Mexican? Uh, oh, bub, we got invited to Mexico. Oh, well. Well, this is my life. I eat, <laughs> I eat the food, you guys go to the country. Okay, the girls are cuddled up inside the bloody thing. There's not enough room in there for me, though, is there? No. no. Definitely not. It's okay though, I bought my jacket. It's getting a little bit chilly. It's not summer yet, it's still spring. But look at this beautiful place. I know I keep saying that, but look, we've got, we're around the other side now, so this is like a sea point area. Yeah. This is why I love Cape Town so much. See you later, son. See you tomorrow, dude. It's my turn to drive. Bub, your window it's is left 100 though. kilos less than it. It's 140 kilos instead of 200. You're gonna kilos. fly over June. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. And don't get me wrong, like, I would buy a 1200. Bye. Bye. See you later, Kale. Wednesday for Table Mountain Missions. Yes. Yeah. Cool. Wednesday for Table okay, Mountain bye, Missions. Bye, Heidi. What? Hugs. Hugs. Yeah. Where's Tranquility Cracks? <laughs> I saw a picture of it today and it looks Where? sick. That is not a real place. I'm Tranquility gonna Google. doesn't sound like a real Yo, place. Bob, but it sounds like a sexual. Thing. Maybe even. One motorcycle purchased. I'm picking that guy up on Monday. Super excited. I can't even explain how fun this motorcycle was. I, you bought that guy. I know, I just straight up bought him. I, I was like, it was about I time. Message. Yeah. It's just one line of baby. I was like, here we go. I'm going to be exploring Atlantis sand dunes on that, learning how to ride better off road. And it's about 100 kilograms lighter than the big BMW 1200 GS that I'm used to riding off road. I'll get one of those massive touring bikes when we actually do some massive touring. Anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Um, in the meantime, remember to work hard, be nice to people, and try not to get lost or killed. I love you guys, goodbye. <laughs> That's one way of putting it. Yeah. I'm not gonna be filling any holes with <laughs> nature's. <laughs> it gets a picture of you getting intimate with a stick. I, I just need to just feel like getting intimate with something. This is what you're here for, man. <laughs>